Arch showdown with championship favourites Blackburn Rovers. It was a match both sides desperately needed to win. Breaker. Klaus got to it. Brewer was uh, hoping that that might be his moment. Well, that's a typical West Ham build-up when Tim Breaker gets involved, Martin. Because he gambles when the ball's on the left-hand side of play. And Bishop spotted him beautifully. Played a great ball into space. And Tim Flowers does really well here. Full stretch. Just gets enough on it. Montcur will take the corner. Reaper. West Ham have taken the lead. Through the big defender, Mark Reaper. His first goal in English football. And it could be a disastrous one for Blackburn Rovers to concede. Well, they don't often concede. I think he's looked said it all. It's a dead set piece. The watch sweeper. He pulls in behind. He almost made them pay first half with a header. He certainly makes them pay this time. Moncur, lovely change of direction to lose Batty. Not panicking. To find Allen. In comes the so foot raised. Breaker. Bishop. There's a ball on here to rush. It's away from Hendry. Blackburn in distress again. Don Hutchison by the far post. Moncur is there as well. Here's Moncur. Here's Hutchison. West Ham believe they're home and dry here. They lead by two goals to nil. And it was all down to the pace of Matthew Rush. You mentioned that they didn't have it in the first half. But on his substitute, the pace is important there. Hen would have won that tackle against most other players. But watch the way he keeps his head. Doesn't pick out Hutchison, they get a bit of luck here. And Tim Flowers doesn't get any. And Don Hutchison drills it straight under the goalkeeper's body. A superb result for the Hammers. Not only had they conquered the Premiership's leading side, and a brilliant boost of confidence that was, destiny was now very much in the Hammers' own hands. There were now four matches left to play, 